Evil Galactic Empire has fallen. No, Star Wars has fallen. This opening sucks. Remember how the Mandalorian opened? Like, boom, right away. We completely understood who he was. Plus, he should have made him shot himself in the mouth. We are no Jedi. Oh, so I can stab him in the armpit? Okay. No, make him shoot himself in the mouth. That would be, like, fucking whoa. That would leave an impact. Stop trying to do the Star Wars hallway Darth Vader scene. You're not going to do the Star Wars Darth Vader hallway scene. This is boring. This is how you're introducing your main character. She's just quiet. <laughs> A Tomb Raider puzzle solver. So what's happened so far? We met some, I don't know, rogue Sith. They freed What's-Her-Face and we have a map. I have no sense of urgency. Like, damn, this is her in the day of. Like, we should be learning about who she is. Like, what are her flaws? What are her ambitions? We got a map for what? I'm not using this stupid text as an excuse. You can do both. Star map? Not just any star map. This one holds the secret Morgan's after. I don't know what that means, and we're just learning that the now. The location of the last missing Imperial Almost Grand Almost 30 minutes Admiral. in. Thrawn. Well, at least we know what she wants now, I guess. That's not Check possible. one off. If Thrawn survived, does that mean Ezra? Who's that? She could say Ezra. Your so. friend, Ezra, your brother, Ezra, your father, Ezra, so. your Padawan. Except our enemies. Instead of just giving us a name. Talk. Wow, she's not like other girls. She has she's just sunset flame hair. Wow. She doesn't do ceremonies. She does stunts. Oh my god, this is giving Frey from Forspoken Vibes hard. There's a cat named Homer. Okay, that was a cool shot. Under the table, we see the, what, Mandalorian helmet. That's pretty good. Okay, so just from this setup, I'm assuming they also want to find Thrawn. Okay. Good setup. Here, and villain want the exact same thing for opposite reasons. But, like, not really? Because it seems like the heroes want to save their friend, but that's also what these bad guys are doing. Ahsoka Tano's former apprentice is on the Thal. You're looking for Sabine Wren. Okay, I do want to say I kind of like the rivalry, I guess, whatever. They're setting up between, like, Pale Goth and her. Because she's, like, all rainbows and stuff and all attitude, self-interest. And the other girl's, like, you know, blank, do what you're told, empty vessel. Y'all, we finally hit our inciting incident. Let's go. The most boring way possible. A conversation. I mean, it is cool to show that she has all this stuff, right? So we like believe her what what she says. But this just should have had, should have come up way sooner. She did accept the call to action, though. Mentoring someone is a challenge. I bet your master found you difficult at times. Dude, why is she being a bitch? Hey, you know your master, Darth Vader. I'm sure he's found you annoying when you were a child. So shut the fuck up. Anakin never got to finish my yeah, training. Yeah, bitch, what the fuck? Before the end of the Clone Wars, I walked away from him. Uh-huh. And the Jedi. Now we do a, a like, master, like, Padawan. Just like I walked away from Sabine. Abandoning people didn't have to be the only lesson you took from him. I'm sure you had your reasons. I do want to say I like the detail of her chipped nail polish. It's like... The, I have myself together at one point. I just can't keep up with it. I'm busy. Finally, some like real fighting. That's tense. And there's stakes. Who's this emo Daenerys chick? Dude, hurry up, man. You're just breaking the tension. Like this is supposed to be. She fucked off, left the Jedi Order, and she's been like camping out and pouting this whole time. She should be getting her ass like beat. 
And also, why she's like along the way, she would have like figured out her own like special unique combat system for her, but yet she's like falling back and relying on her Jedi training, which she gave up years ago. So it's like anytime she's in a, a scuffle, she like whips out a lightsaber, she figures something else out. Gee, I don't know. But people came to see lightsabers, so let's wave the glow sticks. Dude, I don't care. To our friend Ray, Ray who? Ray Skywalker. No, I'm <laughs> that's me. Dave Filoni, you have fallen off, man. Oh my god, this is what happens when you make cartoons and your fans are just children. They don't have any like grown-up expectations, or they don't have any like grown-up taste about what is isn't good. And now you're just like slacking off. Boo. Out of s score of one to five, uh, two. It gets a two.